As you may notice, something changed from last time. It's the PHP Storm IDE, which I find more comfortable working with. But don't worry about that. We will only play with the code from now on, so you should be fine with any editor you are using, as well as the operating system. All Laravel routes are defined in your route files, which are located in the routes directory. These files are automatically loaded by the framework. The routes slash web.php file defines routes that are for your web interface. That is the routes file you should be focused on right now, as api.php and others will come later when we will be building our RESTful API and console commands. Now, if we look in the web.php, we can see that there is one route accepting get HTTP request and when someone requests it, it will return a view named welcome. Let's take a look at that welcome view. It is located in the resources, views and welcome.blade.php. We can see that it mainly consists of HTML code. Let's change Laravel to blog and see what happens at our main page. Great, let's get back to routes. Beside get request type we have post which is also very commonly used. When you are building a RESTful API, there are some other methods available such as put, patch, delete and options. Beside router methods, we have some router functions that are really helpful. Believe it or not, this is not the best way to return a view. We can do the same thing with only one line of code. And in general, you should never put logic code and return a response from a routes file, unless you are doing debugging or something like that. So we just saved ourselves some code lines, which is a great thing and usually a good practice. We turned three lines of code into a single one. 